Hi Libra, welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. Hope you guys are all doing well. This is going to be your December 2021 monthly love reading. I do apologize for being late. You know, it is that Christmas season. Um, which, speaking of Christmas, okay, I'm using Crystal Visions. I am throwing a Facebook party on YouTube. And $30 gets you a six-card reading on my website. A reading for the six cards is $45. But, you know, it's like my gift to my people. So, it's on um, December 22nd, 23rd, sorry. 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And the best dressed person is going to win a $125 reading from me, which is 10 cards with clarifiers. And the winner is going to be picked by chat. So it's going to be a great night, really. Um, if you don't have the community page and, you know, you had no idea about this, um, like I said, the cost is, you know, $30. You could go right to my PayPal here and put in your question and your astrological sign. It fits for two of you, two people, both of your astrological signs. Right in PayPal. Be great. All right, Libra. Okay, Libra. Two of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. Oh yeah, let me move these up. King of Pentacles. Virgo Taurus Capricorn. You have a lot of earth energy sitting here. Emperor, Aries, Taurus. Center of your reading is the lovers. <laughs> wow, the Wheel of Fortune. Wow. The Four of Wands. You with the Queen of Swords. Yeah, the High Priestess. Okay. Well, I definitely. I mean, the lovers, I mean, I can't get past the lovers, and that's in the center of your reading. And some of you could be meeting someone that is very significant to you. 
especially those of you that are single. You have the Emperor, the Wheel of Fortune. Like, there's a lot of major arcana cards here. And there's big changes for you guys this month. If you're single, you definitely have someone coming coming in or maybe they already have because I'm late. Those of you that are married, partnered, you know, there's been like a lot of challenges, obstacles, you know, with the Wheel of Fortune, things are absolutely t changing for the better. It is a card of karma, destiny, and I feel like you're destined to meet someone, you know, with the, with the emperor here, I feel like, like this is for those of you that are coupled, you know, he's stability, security, taking control as far as a relationship with the two of pentacles, there's a lot of ups and downs, you know, relationships that are off. And on an unstable relationship. I just realized, wow, you have the four of wands right under the emperor. Which also represents stability, security, a relationship that has a strong foundation. Like some of you are absolutely seeing big changes within a relationship. Someone has definitely been going back and forth here. Again, it could be that this person comes and goes. You know, and with you here, the Queen of Swords. I mean, here's you. I see you looking at the relationship. You know, with the Page of Pentacles, this relationship has a lot of ups and downs. Highs and lows. You know, you could be dealing with an earth sign, male with the king of pentacles. Again, I see you looking at this relationship with all these ups and downs, a lot of instability. But I strongly feel that there is big changes this month. And I know I'm talking to my females. If you're male with... Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn in your chart. I mean, this definitely could resonate for you. There's big changes this month. Where there is a sense of stability. That's happening because someone is taking control. You know, your energy is here with the Queen of Swords. You know, the High Priestess. Some of you could be questioning someone that's that's not a loyal partner, not a stable relationship. You know, always letting you down. But you know, with the four of wands, you know, that's longevity. You know, so I do see a very stable relationship. I feel like you guys are just going to like really just trust your own intuition on this. You know, is this person, is this the person that, you know, you truly belong with? You know, the second row tells me that, you know, you are looking at a relationship and wondering, you know, if this relationship... Is where you truly belong. Is this person loyal? And you're the only one that knows the answer to that. And trust your intuition. I mean, I am definitely going to um, get more cards. with the Gilded. Libra. Okay, Two of Pentacles. Page of 
And it's all well alright. Well, the magician flipped it right up. Oh my god. Um, Emperor Lover's Wheel of Fortune. Okay, four cups, and the ace of swords. All right, for some of you, you're definitely emotionally unhappy. You know, we're emotionally unhappy because of where you are right now. Whether that be your marriage, your relationship, your love life. You know, the magician is your card. You do have everything you need to make things better. But someone definitely needs to take back control. To kind of bring this relationship, marriage back to balance. Because someone is definitely not happy with the way things are right now. Ace of Swords, there definitely could be clarity, reality. Seeing things as they are. And you have it. You know, with the magician, you could definitely manifest a change within your marriage, relationship. You know, and if you're unsure how to do that, I truly feel with the Ace of Swords, you are going to have like a aha moment. A moment of clarity. The High Priestess is you... The high priestess is, is 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 you're on the you're on you're you're with the right person, or you're married. Whatever it is that you have going on, definitely listen to your intuition because your intuition is guiding you. Because I think really, Libra, you are going to manifest a change, or they are. If it's not you. This person that you're dealing with, which could either be a Gemini or a Virgo. You have Virgo Gemini here too with the magician. But really, with the Ace of Swords, you are gonna have like an like really an aha moment, a moment of just clarity. The high priestess, if you're with the right person or marriage, whatever it is you have going on, definitely listen to your intuition. Okay, Libra, I absolutely love you guys, and I will see you back here soon. Bye.